Hello, and welcome to another video of Hooked on Tool. In today's video, we are going to talk about what you can do about broken wires. It's pretty common for charging cables like this one to the tear at one point, which can be a safety hazard or ruin the quality of the wire. So, we are going to share an easy method for fixing wires like these using a heat gun and a bottle gun. If you do not have a small bottle cap like this one, it's also an option to just use a PVC pipe instead. First, get the cap and put it on a vise like we are doing here. If you do not have a vise, you can try to put the cap anywhere that you are sure it will stay completely in place, but a vise is recommended the most for this. Then, use the heat gun on the bottle cap to melt it a little bit. Keep using the gun on the cap until you notice that it is starting to melt. Once that happens, wrap the cap around the wire like we have here. It will go around easily and develop a new layer on the wire from where it was broken. During this entire process, make sure that you have safety gloves on, because the heat gun will have made the bottle cap very hot. Because of that, it will be easy to burn your hands if you are not careful, but gloves can prevent that and make the job easier. After you are done wrapping the melted bottle cap over your broken wire, use the heat gun once more all over the cap to melt it some more. This will make the bottle cap spread throughout the broken part of the wire and make it stick better. Just make sure that you stay around the cap and not other parts of the cable, because that will burn the wire. Now you need to place the wire on the vise. Make sure that the USB part of the charger is not in the vise and is sticking out, while the cable is held tightly like we have placed it here. After that, just leave it there to dry off. When the cable is dry and hard enough, you can open the vise grip and take the charger out. Now the only thing left to do is to give the cable a nice finish so that it does not look odd. You can see how well the plastic bottle cap stuck with the wire. But, it does not look neat because the plastic melted unevenly and spread out everywhere. So, we are going to use cutters to cut rid of the excess parts. Just get a paper or plastic cutter and start chopping away at the extra bits like we are doing, and then it will look much cleaner. But, the job isn't done yet. Now you need to use the heat gun again on all the rough edges that will be there because you cut through the plastic. This will start to smooth them out and make them melt. As soon as you notice that something like that is happening, grab the wire and start rolling around on a table like we are. That way, it will smooth around the cable and start to take shape. You can also roll it around in your hands like this which will give it a nice finish. Here you can see how the broken wire from the start of this video was quickly fixed with the method we shared in this video. You can also follow this exact method by using a PVC pipe in place of a bottle cap if you do not have one. Just cut the pipe up depending on how much you need, and it will serve you the same as a cap. So, this was a quick way to fix any broken cables you have. Subscribe to Hooked on Tool if it was able to help you out, and if you liked the video.